This will take up too much space. Oh, bollocks, I knew I'd get attacked by a bear. Oh, bloody hell, look at that. There's me saying, oh, we've not seen another bear again, and there's another one. Good morning, good afternoon, good evening. This is Dragonfly Gamer UK, and we are back in Icarus. Um, since the last episode, I've been doing a lot of running backwards and forwards. I've moved over pretty much all my workbenches now. Yeah, took quite a bit of effort, so everything's been pulled back. I've also done quite a bit of sorting out. As you can see, I've actually got my garden plots in there now, ready to be put out elsewhere. Uh, I've been sorting everything out, basically, just to make it a bit easier to find. All my metals and things like that. All my animal parts and plant parts. And another one around here. Yeah, that's all the old parts. There's still some bits left in my building over there behind the trees, you can just see it. But uh, just repeats of what I've got here, really, so it, it's not bothering me too much. Orsius building's now all stone. Uh, what I did do at the end of the, well, while I was running back to forwards, I managed to uh, go up a level. So I think the first thing we need to do is look at those talent points. So we've got three points available. Things I need are, I need to be able to get to electronics. Building electronics so I can start building miners and things like that. But let's have a look, what else do I want? I needed something from tier two, I believe it was a spiked walls. If I'm at a sufficient level to do that. Wood spikes fortification, I believe that's what I was told to get. And so I'll get that. Do all torches at some point, but not are critical at the moment. Yeah, biofuel lamp I could do without. Do I need for this? I need cement. Okay, I could build that. I need to build that. That's a biofuel composter. Basically, you can start making, making biofuel. Yeah, to get electronics, which are going to become critical in the long run, I will need electronics. So let me say it again. Electronics will become critical in the future, so therefore we really need to unlock that. Known as a weather event coming in. So, do I want to spend my additional two points unlocking those? So, look. Increase my forge. I currently have the furnace here. Yeah, get better forge, maybe. Let's go for a better forge and unlocking the gold wire for the time being. Talent points. I have two points available. Let's see what we can do here. Don't we boil some chopping down a tree? The harvesting them at the damage from falling trees. Increased yield from iron deposits, that might be quite useful. Space ones there. Hold on, it's raining, I'm still outside. Let's go back into this. What have we got here? We've got fine butcher, not too worried about that, There's loads of animals around here. Swift stalker, no. Leather breakdown, already got it. Knives degrade slow and skinning, not really bothered about that. Hard to attack when stealth, not really bothered about that. Strong shoulders, not really bothered about that. Swift stalker, no. Cooking and farming, so what have we got here? That could be used. A plus 13 rate of food spoiling, and minus 30 percent rate of food spoiling, I think I'll go for that one. Because food is always the issue with spoiling. And then solo. And um, that's up, that's up, that's up. Increase wood from trees, don't really bother about that. Increase wood, stone and fibre, you'll already got that one. What's this one? Efficient home maintenance, don't really bother about that. More than a handful, increase yield from harvesting by hand. Not too fussed about that. Increase seals from hunting, not too fussed about that. What do we have here? Increased base movement speed, that would probably be useful. Melee damage, that might be quite useful. Increased base health regen, I think we'll go for the movement speed to begin with. Yeah, for now. So that's our point spent. 
biofuel. What do I need to make the biofuel extractor? There it is. I need 20 iron, 8 copper, 12 concrete and 20 screws. Steel screws. So I've got steel and copper in here, I believe. There's a steel and there's a copper. Let's place them in here. Oh, behave. Come on. Being stupid. Um, how many seps I need? After 100 screws. They will last me a while. 12 concrete, so I'm going to need stone for that. I've got a fair bit of stone knocking around. So, concrete. How many can I make? Oh, yeah, I can make 12. There we go. Crap that. Anything else? 20 iron ingots. And there's a 20 iron ingots, although I am getting low on iron now. No, yeah, very low. I do have some um, iron ore elsewhere, which I need to try and smelt down. I'm just going to remember where I put it now. Oh, there we go. So I'll smelt that down quickly. This furnace does turn itself off and activate itself. You don't need to worry about it too much. You don't have to click activate. Plenty of coal in there. It's good. How's my food doing? I'm low on food. Let's see him some of that. Stick the meat on there. Just get rid of it. Spoiled meat well, so I got to... Come on, mother, pass. I will be putting a staircase in here, maybe it's outside, I don't know yet, going up to the next floor. Then I'll start building on the next floor as well, I'll start building up. How's my oxygen do? It should be okay, change. Oh no, it's quite low actually. Much lower than I was expecting. Okay, there we go. That's sort of running back and forwards. And water, the key binding has changed for water, it used to be F. It's now with the latest update, which adds batteries and things. It's now X for some reason. That threw me. Even though it tells you, you get used to not looking at it. I brought my beehive over, but I've got tons of bare uh, beeswax. Um, what else have I got here? Anything to do here, so I can always make some more epoxy. And then take some more bone let's make some more of that how are we getting on with our cement? are we done? there we go, as a cement so, biofuel Craft that, and then I will need a oh, 25 ingots of iron for biofuel can. But painful. Looks like we're going mining. Let's take that for now. This can go here. Let's stick it this way up here. This will take up too much space. Because what you can do is, if you notice here, you can have uh, cooked meat can be turned into biofuel. You need one cooked meat and one tree sap, or raw meat, two raw meat and one tree sap. So it's better to cook the meat before you put in the biofuel burner. Tree sap. We know we've got plenty of tree sap. Take that. Actually, got no cooked meat on there. Um, I do have some in my backpack there, so I can. Took that and dump that. 
but I need a can now. That's so difficult. Oh, I just... How are we getting on with this? Do I have 25 there? You know what, I'm just going to have to use this. I am going to have to go and start mining some more iron. But at least I've got a can. So I can at least kick off the make. Where'd that go? Oh, there it is. Oh, yeah, you just put it in here, don't you? And it makes it. That's it. So that will start making biofuel now. You can see a little green bar will slowly creep up. The other things you can put in here are. Oh, will see fiber, wood, sticks. I found previous one of the good ways of doing it if I've got sticks. Now, any wood down here? So we can see if I've got some wood. No, where'd I put the wood? There we go. Can I hold the sister sticks? Uh, craft. There we go. I look, I did unlock that. So I'll max that. This will fill my inventory with loads of sticks, but it's okay because I'm just about to drop them again. Okay. And now I can stick the sticks in there. And it takes five sticks and one tree sap to produce biofuel. So it meat's more efficient in some ways. It's a good way of just using a meat that you're not e eating. But you can use other things. Oh, I've had something out there, so I'm like a bear again. Right, what time of day is it? It is a bit old, it's early afternoon. Yeah, we've got time to go. Yeah, go on. Let, let's see if we can get to our cave up in the hill and back in time. I'm not bothered about picking him up, he just let him decay. By the time we come back, he'll be gone. That's what my arrow back. Just got to remember where our cave was. was up there, wasn't it? Okay. I said he'd head this way. Oh, bollocks, I knew I'd get attacked by a bear. See, there is a knack to getting these bloody bears and not getting attacked by them. If you can dodge out, just stab them just in time and dodge sideways. If you can avoid an attack. Got him! So pleased. Take that, Mr. Bear. Yeah, I'm not bothered about the rest of Right, which way was I heading? I was heading up here, so hopefully that's him taking care of it while I've uh, finished mining. I so want a gun. This makes it so much easier. I know my health's down a little bit, and I should probably eat something to boost dirt. 30. 30. 30. Okay, so that's an extra 90. Right, where was this cave? It was somewhere around here. I think that was it over there. I think it's over there. Oh bloody hell, would you look at that? There's me saying, oh, we're not seeing another bear again, and there's another one. Oh, he got me. 
Got him. Bloody hell. I'm so glad I ate that food then. Wow. Let's take the meat. Don't care about the rest. Oh yeah, the scissor cave ends here. Right, this could be tricky. So now we have... I turn my light on. Oh, my torch has burned out. Got another torch with me? Sure I have. Oh no, I don't. I must have used it. Damn. Okay. I need half some bits to make a torch. I want to go to the other cogs, so... Because I'll be drawing in um, foxes and things. Yep, yeah, foxes. Wolves and terror horses. Torch, what else do I need? Sticks. A bit more fibre. Craft that. You yeah, see, it's brought in a warthog there. Now, I don't know why warthogs. I didn't think warthogs would eat carcasses, but I guess they would actually. Yeah, pigs eat meat, so. I guess they do. Right, let's have a sneaky bout in here, see what we try to get avoided. Killed. Not to get killed, I mean. Take that. Oh, stick. Wait for the bees. Oh, there's the bees up there. So there's a nest. Come on bees, come and get me. The sitting duck. No, you don't want to come and attack me? That's it, got them. Right. Mining. I need iron. And for those of us, uh, those of our American friends, I probably sound a bit strange in the way I say certain things. Um, that was because I'm from the very north of England. Uh, I grew up with a very, very strong Northern English accent. I must have spent the last 30, 35 years living in the south of England. I've still got a bit of my old accent. It's unlikely I'll never get rid of it completely. So that's why I've got a bit of a twang to my voice. That's why, and that's why I say sing, uh, certain things, maybe in odd order or use some unusual words. But clusters of Geordie in the UK, which is uh, from the very northeast of England, the nearest city of Newcastle upon Tyne. It's an amalgamation of Saxon, English, and Norse, the Viking and languages, along with a bit of pick, which is Scottish. So we say things, yeah, very strange sometimes. And even people in England can't understand, my boy, can't understand the jewelry when uh, they've got a really strong accent, which I used to have. Right, I need to dump some weight. So what am I carrying too much of that I can get rid of? So I think that's just mine down now. What don't I want? How much of a... Oh, that is quite heavy stuff, so... I might just drop that. Yeah, totally was heavy. Let's <clears throat> quick look around. I don't think I need to come back in here other than to place a deep... Mining... 
Tip over, mine. Og dip over vane, mine. Oh, hvor er det kommet. Right, at home, it's getting late. Where is my... Okay, so head this way. Crap, that's not what I wanted. What you don't want when you're out in the open amongst trees is a bloody lightning storm. Might have to go to my old base. Crap, which is the best way? This way. You can't get struck by lightning. And yes, it hurts. That was a bit close. Hello, a storm. Come on, keep moving. Oh, no, the strike over there. You're right, I'm at safety at last. Yeah, uh, yeah, you can see I actually cleared everything out from up here. I know I built this to put stuff in it, but I've cleared out subsequently. Or subsequently cleared out to move my bits down to my new building. What I will do is... Not pick anything up, because I've already spaced my backpack. I can pick things up to there. I can destroy that. Don't need that. Pick this up. I can go in there for now. I'm overloaded again. No, I can't do that. Okay. Stick us in there. Come it down here. Okay, the lightning's passed. Um, oh, it's still blows. that that's quite heavy spot. Yeah, burning tree. Pray the burning tree gods. Yep. Yeah. That's what happens when you get struck by lightning. Oh, I hear strange noises at night in this game. Right, up we go. to our base. So one thing I'm missing in here is torches actually. So I have none of these torches um, set up anyway. Fuck hey. I think they've changed some of the key other key bindings as well in the game so in the last update. It was quite a bit of big update apparently. Uh, adding batteries and, and wanting another to the game. I want to make some more steel, so let's just sort all this out to begin with. Dump all the iron in there, and then bring some back. Well, that'll give me 50 iron ingots. So, the iron can go in, the copper could go in, and the platinum can go in. Anything else on me? A poison sack. Aluminium, that can go in, and titanium. And this is all coal ore. So, I'll just top up that up. Put that in there for now, just to keep it safe. Don't need all that on me. No, just let all that smelt down. The fire is out, so actually, you know what? I will take 50 of that and put it in my fire. And drop the meat in there. Right. 
But I can go in there. The other animal bits. So you can go in there. The bees. Bit sticks. So I can go in there. And they can go in there. Yeah, let's just sort this lot out quickly because it's all muddled up when I reload it for some reason. Okay, so uh, we're now making biofuel. The next thing I want to do is maybe stop making some defense down here just to run. Hello, you said you could come up here. Look up. Hello, look up. Smile. Hello. Up here. No. Okay. Well, you wanted it the hard way. If you looked up, I mean, one swift stab, and that would have been it. I was mum about somewhere. No. Just skin me pretty. Something's about, I can hear it. Yep, so what I'll do is I'll, uh, I'll stop building some defence around here. And I also need to build something. Cover up Russell Cliff. Scrap. I also need to build something just over here because this is actually a route up. And I and the beasties can get up this hill. So I need to block that off. Be quite a successful day. We've got some more coal, some more ores. We've got um, kill two bears without having to rely on being in water. That's a good day in my account. So, cheers, guys! Please hit the like and subscribe button and leave a comment. Uh, it really does help me if you just hit that like button, helps me. And I appreciate your support. This is Dragonfly Gamer wishing you a good night.